Okay. After our presentations, please feel free to ask any questions if you need. Hope you can enjoy our presentation and have more understandings about okay, so this is the future they make their presentation in front of the green screen only. At the beginning we were in a little tiny room, so now we're going to be we'll in a big, this big room here. Opportunities in our business. And let me show you the result. So then we take that and we... Good evening, the, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Wow. Welcome to wow. Jopong Investor Conference. I'm the PR of, uh, I'm the PR practitioner of Jopong. My name is Joe. And this is our CFO, Panda. Good evening. Here, I would like to thank you for taking your time to come here. In the following five minutes, so we will talk about the financial here. status of our company. After our presentations, please feel free to ask any questions if you need. Hope you can enjoy our presentation and have more understandings about Jopong's future opportunities. At the beginning of our presentation, then, we'll explain the profitable opportunities is, in our business. I take the, Second, uh, it's heavy in the financial status, which include the difficulty the video, we face. And then I add me. <laughs> and then I'm on one side and you're on the other side. Like I'm on the left side, you're on the right side. And so you can listen to me or you can listen to you and I'm talking about how to improve your presentation. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Jopong Investor Conference. A I'm good the introduction. Over, uh, I'm the PR mm -hmm. practitioner of Jopong. Nice and so smooth. You your left or right and listen this is our CFO oh, yeah, Honda. Feel relaxed. Here, I would like to thank you for taking your time to come here. In the following five minutes, we will talk about the financial status of yeah, our like company. Like the introduction of what we're going to do, how much time it's going to take. Feel free to ask any good. questions if you need. And I like this. I like this how one line, one line, one line, and it all adds up to be interesting. At the beginning of our presentation, we'll explain the profitable opportunities in our business. Okay, so this is our Second. goal. Our goal is to shoot the video with you, making your presentation, and then to green screen it so it looks so professional like that. And then also I give you advice. And then you listen to my advice, and then you try to improve. And then next, the next time we do another one, different different subject, but maybe same company. So you'll choose one company, and for that one company, you'll do maybe four presentations. And we'll probably do our presentation every two weeks. Okay. Okay. So you can use later. You can we and we'll put this on the web. And also, we're going to put our class, like here I'm talking on the web also. And you can use this here. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome and you can use this in your e-resume, because it looks very good. This could be something you use in a resume to show your skill. Okay? So you want to do a good job. We also want a chance to learn things, so that's what our goal is in this class. So today we begin our presentation part of our class. Right, much more interesting than uh, APA. Mm. Yes? Okay. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to begin by uh, your company. Right? What company do you choose? Right? So let's go ahead and I think I asked each group to think of, did I say two or three companies? Three. Three, right? Okay. Okay. I, I still haven't. Decided what group I'll be in. We're not having groups. Yes? Yeah. You don't have groups yet? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, you have to make a group. <laughs> okay, so why don't we do this? Why don't we take a break now and you make your groups? You have to make your group, and then we need three company idea. And I'm going to go get my small computer, I'm going to get some tea. And so we'll have a break now, and, but I need you when I come back. I have to have a group and three companies, okay? And the companies should be uh, overseas international companies so you're easier to find English information because your presentation is in English, right? Okay? Of course, it could be a multinational company like Lenovo or something like that, but it has to be big enough that you can find English information, okay? All right, any, qu any other thing we need to cover before then? No more than three people in a group. 
actually two is if you have more people in your group, the problem is how do you make a presentation with so many people? It's not easy. I have a question about how long for the presentation. Presentations are five minutes. Five minutes. Um, we have ten in the class. So one should do alone? I'm sorry? You told us that there shouldn't be more than three people. In one group. Yeah. It could be one person in a group or okay. two people in a group. <laughs> now. The advantage of one person is you do everything yourself, but the disadvantage is it's a little bit too much work. Mm -hmm. Two people is kind of perfect because you can split up the work. Mm -hmm. you, have to find, you have to find information, you have to write it, you have to think of it, you have to practice it, right? You need to practice. It's not just, you know, do it without practice, you need to practice. But three people, the problem is with three people, it's hard to decide how to present. Right. If the screen looks like very small, if there's three persons, how could they stay? Right, it's not easy. Well, I mean, the problem is if there's three people and I want to show all three people, they all become tiny. So, I mean, it's not really, <laughs> not really very, very helpful, you know. So, it's okay. You can do three people. We've had, have, we've had students do three people before. Let me see. Did you look at the examples online? I, I have them all online. At my, um, I have to open up the web page. So, let me see. Um, yes. When you've got three companies in one group and no. you choose one. Right. Yeah. You have three Proposed possible, pro pro proposed, and then I'll say which one is best. Okay. okay. And then you choose one company for the whole semester. Mm -hmm. So you'll focus on one company. And the topics are going to be, at the beginning, you are introducing your company to investors. Another one is you're introducing your, uh, a new product from the company. Another one is you're introducing something about the finance of the company. So it's all business topics. Right? And they're not general topics. They're very, very specific, like finance, like, like a product, like a stock, things like that. Okay. All right, so I'm going to take a break then and you choose your companies, all right?